everyone and welcome to our very unexpected robot reveal. In this video we will show you the results of two days of strategic brainstorming and five days of prototyping, CAD designing and building. There we go! Enjoy! I've been thinking about our love. When the game was announced, we immediately noticed that the barriers on the playing field would have a huge impact on the drivetrain. Fortunately, after some testing, we found out that we can still go over the barriers with mechanic wheels. However, it won't be possible to go over the barriers with odometry, which we usually use for autonomous. Oh, no. We've chosen the 96mm uh, Go Build Up uh, wheel chassis. That way, we can still drive in every direction, but we can safely go over every, uh, every barrier and safely move around the field. We also made our chassis small enough so that we could drive next to the barriers. Being able to pick up and drop things is crucial during this game during Teleop. So we decided to make different systems to try out different strategies. In addition to this, we had to be fast to keep our cycle time low. Our first prototype was made out of Lego. It worked very well, so we decided to make the same system but from plates cut by our laser cutter. It uses sweepers to sweep in balls and boxes and ducks. Being fast is our number one priority. We also made a different version which contains a magnet. This allows us to sort out the heavy blocks. However, with that we cannot pick up any balls or ducks. In the future, we hope that we may be able to combine these arms into one. We also made a simple wheel which allows us to score the ducks from the carousel. We think this is one of the easier things to do since you only need a motor and a wheel and in the end game you can score up to 54 points. We use a Canon drive to make sure we can drive in any direction we want. We also make sure we use field centric drive. This means that from the driver's perspective, if he wants to do a right, go to the right, the robot will always drive to the right, no matter the orientation of the robot. We do this by using the internal measurement unit. So basically, this was our robot in one week video. We hope you enjoyed it and you have an amazing season. Woo! Good luck! Right, Frenzy. Frenzy. Let's, Let's go! go. Let's go.